Hello everyone, uh, John from Jolly John's here. Um, this is the new Apollo build. Uh, as you can see, it's got quite a good layout. Uh, nice large font, which is easy to see. Uh, it's got very uh, easy navigation. Quite a, a few good add-ons included in the build. Uh, all of them seem to be popular ones, at least the ones that you can get to quickly. So let's have a quick look at it. So here we have, you know, to quit you don't really need that to be explained I'm sure uh, you know but for those who don't just closes quits Cody here we have our music so top tracks you just go up and you can scroll across quite a good selection there top tracks it will go on for quite a while uh, there's also if you go down the bottom we have the additional add-ons for music and as you can see there's quite a few good ones there so there's no shortage of selection it seems to be a really good build um, next one across kids so as you can see we have a good selection of movies uh, and titles up here by going above it all you have to do um, you can use a mouse or you just press up and until you're on that line and then just scroll, scroll across um, quite a good selection and once again it has quite a few good kids based add-ons there as you can see underneath by pressing the down button or using your mouse to go down to it so it's got some good add-ons uh, good selection there so go up again to the menu bar and go across the comedy as you can see is again quite a good selection of comedy titles there uh, it's a good selection of uh, sure is enough to entertain most people uh, back down underneath uh, we have some uh, a few add-ons here, UK comedy and so forth, stand-up comedy uh, movies uh, below it we have a good selection of uh, working add-ons, popular add-ons such as Silent Hunter, Exodus and Movie Mix uh, there's also a 123 Movies, Movie Vault a good selection of add-ons there and as you can see by going up again above the menu bar we have a very good selection of titles here uh, better point out that some of these will be cam versions um, and cams crap I wouldn't even bother even if it was a good move I would rather go and watch it at a cinema any day than to watch a cam um, you know it's, and really honestly like if you're going to be watching movies you know they need to um, they need money to make good movies otherwise they're just going to be making things like Star Wars 57 Pirates of the Caribbean 84 uh, so you know if you can afford it go out and support them um, 4k and 3d movies this would be really good option for anyone with an ultra HD TV um, even though the 3d movies are being phased out uh, it's still got a few selections there and they'll, while ever they're producing 3d movies for home entertainment they'll still be available so as you can see down below we got some good add-ons uh, for 3d content which is um, it's not a huge selection of add-ons but then again it's a, a dying industry um, and then up above we have a good selection of 4k movies to choose from next one across we have TV shows once again it's got a lot of your popular um, add-ons at the bottom such as UK uh, shows it's got Exodus, Salts, uh, TV Mix and Lucky TV uh, and the list goes on and on and on um, if we have a look at the titles above the top you can see it starts off it's got some break it's got Breaking Bad, Game of Thrones, Walking Dead it's obviously got the most popular ones Big Bang Theory and so forth uh, it's a very good selection it's so easy to navigate uh, these titles are taking a little while to come on because uh, I have not got the fastest of internet connections here uh, next we go across to the Bob um, very good selection of different sorry I'll get there uh, different uh, areas to uh, choose from and you can see we've got box sets and so forth kids music TV Oscars and the list goes on and again a good selection underneath as well uh, we also have Evolve just wait for my internet to pick up a little bit 
and it's just taking really long time but it doesn't matter uh, we also got Phoenix um, a dedicated area for Phoenix add-on as well uh, if anyone who is unfamiliar with Phoenix very similar to Salts and uh, Exodus uh, so as you can see it's got some options down below for different categories and then subcategories and uh, selections up the top uh, UK Turks really good and popular add-on has a lot of uh, different content so you know live TV sports it's a fantastic add-on very popular as you can see it's got the titles above and the categories below Vortex I'm not really familiar with this add-on uh, it is one I'd like to play around with a bit but um, it's uh, it's there as well and I'm not really familiar with metallic as well but I'm sure it'll be pretty good Doc Hub obviously a documentary add-on um, I don't know how extensive their list of uh, ad of uh, content is but it's it's there it's worth a look on demand as you can see there we have uh, renegade starts and so forth other selections underneath as well as the options up the top TV live now this would be great for uh, obviously live streaming TV now it's worthwhile pointing out that uh, there are three things that will affect uh, buffering of live TV so if um, if you find it is buffering a lot and possibly even disconnection disconnecting it's going to be one either the device you're using is not powerful enough to stream the content two your internet is not good enough or three the servers aren't good enough so if you've got a fast enough device and your internet is fast enough there is absolutely nothing you can do about the third option which is the servers uh, if there's just too many people on them it's going to struggle it's it's like uh, looking at a 10 lane freeway going down to a two lane freeway you all these cars going along and then all trying to get into two lanes and it just stops the traffic which is what you see when it's buffering but um, and also they I've noticed with a lot of uh, the live TV streams they up and down in and out they don't always work uh, they might disappear for a while and then come back so there's quite a few here as you can see no shortage of different uh, options and that's just going to go on forever I'm not even going to scroll through that and there's a few good different uh, add-ons down the bottom which offer the live streams hot picks and you can see we've got some good options down here such as IMB the IMDB top 300 clean eastward and a few others and then we have a sports add-on so as you can see good selection of sports add-ons there um, surely to satisfy a lot of people and then we have help health which is got some different add-ons there favorites tracked plex and then back to our add-ons so we can install additional add-ons to the system that um, may come out from time to time obviously the adults version of this is going to have an additional menu item there for adult content um, but I didn't install this one because I want to upload it to YouTube without getting a strike okay so now that we've had a quick look at this add-on um, I'm going to show you how to install it on Kodi 16 okay so this is how we go ahead and install the Apollo build first of all we gotta to go to systems then file manager add source select none and enter the URL make sure you get it exactly how it's entered a lot of Android devices will need it to be um, HTTP colon slash slash some of them will miss the second slash so just make sure you've got that second slash once you've entered the URL exactly how it is there select done then give it a name I'm going to call it Apollo and then select done and then select OK after that's done we want to go back to the home screen and select system then we go down to add-ons get rid of that and now you select install from zip file 
select the uh, file that you chose, um, which is Apollo for me, and then select Apollo to zip. Now after we've done that, we just have to wait for the add-on enable notification to appear in the bottom right hand corner. It can take a little while depending on the speed of your internet and of the, sp the speed of the servers um, where the file is hosted. And there we go, the add-on has been enabled. So what we want to do now is go back to the home screen and again to programs. Select the Apollo Wizard 2.1 and then just select one of the builds you want. A uh, few to choose from. Uh, we're going to do an Apollo one. As you see, uh, Apollo Triple X Dream no price for what that's going to be. Uh, Apollo Light. Um, that is obviously a, a version for uh, low-end devices, dual-core Android boxes, Fire Sticks, and so forth. And then Apollo AI1, which will, will which is the one I will try and install. And now, it's worth pointing out that um, this build will have to be installed on a clean installer Kodi. So that basically means if you've got Kodi installed in your box and it has any add-ons, you're going to have to delete Kodi completely, then reinstall it. Now if it's an Android box, for example, you can de delete it uh, go by going through assist, uh, settings and then going to the Play Store and installing it again. If uh, you happen to find an add-on that you use which isn't in part of this build you can use um, one of the guys online one that I've got or one that someone else has got to reinstall that on add-on which you use but you'll find that a lot of good add-ons popular add-ons will be part of the build um, it will take a little while to download um, I know I tried to do this earlier but my internet dropped out and this is my second attempt it seems like their server may be a little bit slow and may take you know, maybe half an hour to download so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to skip through the boring part and once it's finished downloading and extracting it should force close um, or you may have to select the force close uh, if you're on Android box that means you're going to have to remove the power wait about 10 seconds or so and then power your box back on if you're a Windows device just close it down restart it um, Firebox, just uh, Fire Stick, sorry, just disconnect the power and restart it. Once you open Kodi again, you should have the brand new build. Okay, so we've just finished downloading and extracting the Apollo build, and once it's finished, you'll get this little notification up. Unfortunately, the only way to get the new changes to stick is to force close Kodi. Click OK to force close Kodi. Uh, do not use the quit exit options. In code. That basically means just force close it, click OK on a PC and then confirm it will be done. If you're on Android box or Fire Stick just disconnect the power, wait for 10 seconds and then plug it back in. So right now I'll just click OK and then it should come up with we'll confirm. Yes confirm. OK and here's the new Apollo build. Um, as you can see it's fairly well laid out. It's got a kit section, music, options there for add-ons and so forth. Um, up at the top we're actually going through doing the, all the updates because um, the add-ons which are installed with it you know pro may not have been updated for a while. Um, comedy movies 4K and 3D. Don't know if 3D is actually going to be much use for much longer. Uh, it's up to you. You'll get these uh, little notifications um, like this, I know Live Mix has been dead for a while. I personally won't disable it just in case they bring it back online, but it's up to you. Um, again, more like that. Um, as you can see, we keep going along. TV shows, um, it's got the add ons underneath. Um, Bob, which I've got to do a uh, tutorial for. Um, Evolve, 
Phoenix, UK Turks, Vortex, Metallic, Doc Hub, On Demand, TV Live, Hot Picks, Sports, Health, and then Favorites, as well as Tracked, Plex, and then back around. Okay, well, I hope this um, tutorial was helpful. Please uh, subscribe uh, and like the video, and uh, we'll try to upload more and more as we go along. Okay, thanks for watching.